And so we want to look at how I would change my slide from this to this. It's very simple and easy to do that. All right. We do this you're using the placeholders or the slide layout. When I have a new slide, for example, this, we call this the placeholders. So these are the placeholders and you can change it to anywhere you want. Now this slide contains an already built in layout that I can use to do the presentation. I just need to only add text and remove text. But if I want to add a new slide to it, just what I just did right now, you come to new slide and you can add any layout at all you want to. If I don't, can just click on new slide and it will give me an automatic slide which is the one I selected earlier on. So if you don't want this particular slide, you will want to delete it. That is deleting a slide or the thumbnail here that you don't want. Just select the slide as it is here and you press backspace on your computer or you can press the delete button to delete it or you right click and click on delete slide and go. One, press the backspace on your keyboard or the delete on your keyboard and the third one is you right click on the slide and you choose the delete slide to remove it so you click on right click and delete it from here now we can change the layout of this slide this layout the by using the layout from the home tab you click on it and i can change it from here right you can see that it has been changed this one you are not adding a new slide you are only changing the arrangement of the placeholders inside there now i can change it again to this all right now the placeholders when you open it up it will tell you what and what to do you can see there's a picture here it's a click icon to add a picture so i can click on the, this icon and will send me to my computer so i can choose if i have any picture that i want to insert i can choose that and insert so if i go to my download i have a lot of pictures that i have edited and then so i can just choose this one and do insert then it's coming to be inserted into that one and you can resize it the way you want so that is the function of the placeholders and when you see the icon that means you are going to insert a picture or i just click here and start adding text all right and you can adjust it to fit what you want to do now i can change this layout again just by clicking on the layout here and selecting any of the layout that i want and you see it has randomly arranged it for me and i can also add text from this layout or this placeholder so this is how you manipulate the slide now what next we want to look at adding a new slide you you may want to put a slide to this one just click below it the slide you this way you want to put the slide in if you want the slide to be here you just click on it and you come to choose the slide so insert and it's going to be inside that area now if i have inserted a slide at the wrong place i may want to move it so you click on it and drag it to wherever you want to replace it so i want to put it under here and that is how you rearrange your slide so i can rearrange the slide to anywhere i want it to be 
okay know that if you are adding a new slide maybe we, we're using it an already template made template and your other things and whatever you are putting here may contradict or may not make your work nice again so all you have to do is that I can leave the placeholders instead of dragging them which may distort the correct presentation that was made nice for me I can just come to the design tab and I choose the teams you can choose the teams from there so we have different different teams you can use and each team gives you a, a different variant of colors and all that I can also come to the vibrant and likewise I do the same so you can see it this way let me see so you just decide to hover over it and see the one that best suits your design so if you are not getting it clear here let me choose a one that is having a picture so let's pick this one for example so we now come to the design tab and on the team group you just hover your thing and look around so each team comes with its own layout so you, as you can watch you see the movement that is happening so each team comes with its own layout okay so you hover around it to see the one that you will like and when you see that one you just choose it and then you are good to go so that is how you manipulate with the microsoft um powerpoint in your slide so if you are getting this and you are not getting it more i can come to browse for more that is if i have an old if i downloaded some themes in my my scene i can come here and put it that's browse for more you can come and put it from there if you don't have them downloaded you can just search for it and then you are good to go good now that i have selected one of the but i think this one doesn't look nice more no so let me see i want a more nicer one so this design is subjective it depends on you so what is nice to me might not be the same way you want but in all you have, you have to choose the one that the colors are appealing and the visible for people to see now i can change the vibrant and that is the color and all that okay you can change it from here you can change the color settings now you can do a lot of things with this slide so i can go further and format the background of my slide just by changing the picture field i can change the gradient solid and you can change the color of the whole background here from this side and i can resize the slide let's say where you are going to project the screen is very small you can use the standard 4 by 3 screen to use it or the 16 by 9 that is if you have a large screen if you want to customize it by yourself you can choose it here so this is where you arrange your slide okay so just playing with the slide you get to know more about it so we are just giving you an introduction to it but i hope this has blessed you so much please don't forget to hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that when i release any other new video you'll not be left out thank you for watching